Welcome back ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Just Shake or Steer, my name is George and I truly hope you had a wonderful week and you are ready for the weekend, so if you're not, I'm here to help you with something. Uh, it's summer, holiday time nearly, kids going on holiday and maybe not the same year as every year, we all gonna travel to holidays because of certain situation. We most of us maybe need to stick at home and make the most of the summer so why not try some simple but lovely cocktails to help your summer mood and obviously keep you going through the weekend so today we're doing a fantastic cocktail called Caribbean Joy now when you hear Caribbean you think about music, Rome beach and lovely you know atmosphere all the time nice and warm but in this case we're not gonna use Rome. Okay. I say it. Yeah? And now everybody, ooh, go away. Caribbean cocktail without Rome. Well, no every Caribbean cocktail is with Rome. So today the Caribbean Joy, it's made with a Scotch whiskey. Yes. But however, we have a touch of Caribbean vibe inside, let's put it this way, with the Cointreau, which is obviously orange liqueur. And we have fresh lime squeeze juice and we're gonna breathe some sweetness with a lovely powdered sugar. Yes, no syrups, no nothing. And when I'm saying syrups, just before I start making the cocktail, make sure you tune this Sunday because it's gonna be the first of the episodes when I'm gonna start presenting homemade ingredients. And this Sunday we're starting with a simple sugar syrup and a honey syrup. So make sure if you're new to the channel, to hit this subscribe button so you get notified there's a small bell next to it if you click you can choose to get notified for every video which i upload and of course don't forget be nice give a little like it'll be nice anyway let's start making it caribbean joy so it's all making the shaker i'm gonna chill i'm gonna chill the shaker first just a quick Atsi, lovely, look at that steam, beautiful. Right, all we need is a scotch whiskey, so grab your favorite scotch whiskey. I'm using JB because I really like it and it's happened to have it on the shelf. But, grab your favorite scotch, yeah, it has to be a scotch whiskey. So we're gonna go with 40 ml of scotch whiskey. This cocktail is uh, pretty much scotch orientated but because the scotch is very nice and settled it's soft it doesn't have pitiness it's a lovely you know just with a lot of ice to drink when it's in the cocktail especially with the citrus it's a very settled and very soft fantastic actually refreshing so that's why it's called Caribbean Joy now we need 30 ml of fresh lime juice now you can rub a little bit like this Roll your lime or lemon just to break a little bit inside so it's giving you more juice. Let's cut it in half. And it's kind of a bit precise. Try to be precise. So we're gonna squeeze 30 ml of lovely fresh lime juice. There you go. I think I may need a little bit more lime. Now, depends on the limes. If you look at uh, this one, it's like a tiny ping pong. It's not gonna give me so much juice. I mean, it's a very juicy, but well, maybe it may be wrong me. Let me just see. Yeah, I think I may be wrong. I'm gonna make a, just a double check. Well, 25 mil, okay? 25 mil, the original recipe requires 30, so we're gonna go with 25, okay? It won't be a big deal. Okie dokie. Then we need uh, sugar, so no crystal, no any demerara sugar, no nothing like that. We need a one bar spoon, or if you don't have a bar spoon, a teaspoon, like a full teaspoon of nice powdered sugar. You may say, why are you not using sugar syrup? Well, you could do, okay. But I love following the recipes when I find in old books. It's kind of a nice, that's the whole point of the bartending and mixology. To experiment and to find 
why they made the recipe like that. But however, if you want to use sugar syrup, feel free. Finally, all we need it's a few drops of Cointro. So a few drops for me, it's like a five mil. Uh, there we go. If that is few drops, fair enough. Not much, yeah? Not much happening. But trust me, it's a lovely. Let's shake it. Give it a good shake, you gotta chill this and obviously break the sugar inside. You need to make sure it's mixed because you don't using sugar syrup. And grab your glass. Now, if you have a kind of a break ice or pebble ice, it'll be fantastic. If not, obviously just use whatever ice you have. As it happened, I have some kind of a break ice from the freezer which it's not the full, you know, full ice, so I'm gonna use it. Then strain, don't need a double strain. We want all this line to go in, in the glass and let's put it in. This is gonna be a fantastic summer refreshing joy. So that's why it's called Caribbean Joy. And of course, because it's with lime, it's Caribbean. Let's garnish it with a wedge of lime. And it's not gonna be pretty much like a garnish, we're just gonna give a little squeeze and drop it in. And finally, doesn't say in the recipe, but because my garden is full with mint, seriously, I will show you when I do the mint syrup, but it's like a full. I decide to give it a little, you know, garnish like a mint. And of course, the mint is gonna give a little bit more freshness to the cocktail so when you drink it you're gonna feel that lovely smell of fresh mint and let's see if I can pop this one as well why not beautiful let's try oh soon you put you smell the mint straight away and wow Definitely, I'm ready for the Caribbean. I don't know about you, but I'm ready. However, beautiful. Citrusy, fresh, with a touch of orange. A lovely warmth from the scotch. It's just fantastic. And you don't feel the scotch that much like you think you're gonna feel. So, ladies and gentlemen, once again, this is the Caribbean joy for you. If you like this video, of course, again, I'm gonna ask you, don't forget, hit the like button and consider to subscribe if you're new to the channel because more yummy things like this coming your way. Until then, enjoy your weekend, make the most of it. Don't forget on Sunday to tune about the new series of homemade ingredients starting with a simple syrup and a honey syrup. And I'll see you on Sunday, obviously, but enjoy your weekend. Until then, I'm gonna go enjoy this Caribbean joy. Bye.